Hello, Mateo. Uh, thanks for joining me. Right. So before everything, like what I wanted to ask you is like, can you present yourself, present Ziklar, what you guys do, how many people are you and what is your stage? Hey, Jorge. Uh, we've been together since uh, the very first time. My name is uh, Matteo, Matteo Penso. I'm co-founder and chief executive at Ziklar. Ziklar is an AI-driven platform to transform, distribute, and track text-based microlearnings to basically any corporate chat client on the on the market. Um, we are raising our pre-seed money. We closed our first uh, round back in December with 600k, and now we are uh, on to fresh money to to accelerate our growth uh, further. And can you describe a little bit why uh, why you do? ethical hacking or you do pen testing as a small uh, startup and uh, what were your challenges before you do this testing so as a as a company um, our our philosophy is that quality it's our ultimate goal and we treat a lot of client data and we believe that the protection and the security of this data is part of the product they're buying or the product that we are offering. And that's why we want to achieve maximum security on every possible layer of our product. Okay, that's, that's awesome. So like, do you see benefits when you are selling to enterprises, when you are selling to your customers, when you use, when you say that you put security first, uh, do they ask you for that? Um, a portion of our of our target it's composed by large and very large scale enterprises. So as part of the acquisition process, we have several deep dive with the uh, cybersecurity teams, and obviously they dig deeper into not just how we how we treat their data, but also how we protect their data. And as said before, we're a small company, we're a very early stage startup. And it would be impossible for us to have a ethical hacker on, on the team. And that's why, where I believe Etihad plays their, their, uh, the majority of their role, helping us making our software secure and reliable for our clients. Okay. And would you recommend why we recommend this service to other startups? Why do you think that startups should start as you start? doing security from day zero? Because they don't do it, right? If you ask the average startup, uh, they believe their code is secure or they believe they can postpone making their code secure. But the thing is, it might never happen. But if it happens that the co their code is broken, then it's a mortality event for uh, the entire company. And as the, the chief executive of, of, of Zikler, I believe it's my super important role to make my company secure, not just today, but also tomorrow and the day after tomorrow. Thank you so much, Matteo. Like, as you said, like we have been together since day zero. We met each other as a, a founders uh, in the first days of our companies. And we have been having a re very good relationship. And I hope we continue to do that. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you, Harge.